Okie dokie, hello everybody, it's Jeff Tech RuneScape Park, oh, RuneScape Park Productions. I am making a test video here to make sure I fixed all the bugs on my computer. So, with that saying, that is the reason why I have not been uploading videos. I did get some new games I want to do videos of for you guys, but I've been getting a blue screen of death error. To the point to where I couldn't even run software to fix it. Because that would just trigger it even faster. <laughs> So luckily I had a spare hard drive that had a uh, Windows 10 Pro on it, so I got that booted up, repaired, fixed. Running good now, so we're going to look and see how long it takes for this to crash. Uh, so we're going to do a very, very, very quick game here. Uh, let's see, we're going to go to my favorite map. Uh, if I can find it. There we go. Uh, there we go. And we're just going to have a little fun here for a little bit. Uh, I do have to leave here in a little bit too, but I finally got this thing where it's running. It's stable for now. Uh, we're, we're just going to see what happens. Because I do have some new games I really want to play for you guys. There we go. So we're going to see how long it takes for this game to crash. Boom. Wait for a second. Yeah, I'm playing with some very weak, dumb AIs. But that's okay, it's gonna make the match go by quicker. So people actually do ask why I always do, uh, you know, versus bots and everything. I like to do it to test out new weapon attachments, so that way when I actually play a game, I know how much damage they do, uh, what weapon attachment is right for me, instead of doing it during a live gameplay and costing the team the game, because there are a lot of diehards on here. Boom. Server swap. Nah. There we go. Get the heavy out. Man, I hate when you respawn swap. That's actually why I don't play this map on Hardcore Team Deathmatch, because how bad the spawn swaps are. Boom. Cover, reload. Keep that saw someone back there. Oh yeah. So yeah, we're, oh, we're almost done with this match. She 
shit. <laughs> Guess I don't have cripple load on this one. So I'm thinking about doing a video with my buddy, since we pretty much have all the same Call of Duties. That, uh, look through Call of Duty throughout the ages, from Black Ops to Modern Warfare. And just seeing how far the gameplay has come, from multiplayer, zombies. Just take a look at everything. Boom. Yeah, these AIs are way too easy. But nonetheless, they're serving the purpose of me testing out weapons and to see what attachment really works best. You made that look easy. Bravo's a look. Proud to have fought alongside you. I figured that was going to be the best play. So yeah, when when in doubt, when you get new weapons unlocked, especially when you get new attachments unlocked, uh, test them out in bots versus actual gameplay, so that way you're not trying to figure out, okay, what attachments are the best, I should have gone with this one, now I can't use this weapon, or this one looked awesome but actually sucks, so it's, it's good to do that, and that's what I do a lot, so... I'm in this mode a lot, testing out all my weapon customizations to find the perfectly tuned weapon. Now, of course, that varies with zombies for, like, uh, this one, um, Black Ops 3, where you can't really test the weapons out because zombies is different, obviously, than multiplayer, so I got weapons specifically set up for zombies and then one set up for multiplayer, and then one's even set up for hardcore. So this is, again, the best way to test out all your weapons attachments to make sure you got the right one before you go out and play. And hopefully, if I get this Friday off, if not Saturday, I will be doing this hopefully with some buddies, playing some Vanguard, and uh, just having some fun. So if you like this video, please subscribe and leave comments. So far, the, this, it hasn't crashed, so I'm happy about that. So, again, please subscribe, leave comments, and as always, have a nice day, live love, and game on.